Hello everyone. Today we are going to talk about a non-contact infrared thermometer gun by Joe Pharma Private Limited. So let's get started. It's a make in India product. The model number of this product is Joe 600. As you can see, it has a white seal on the top of the box which has the company name on it along with manufacturing date verifying its authenticity. The packaging is very good and has a Joe Pharma Private Limited trademark logo on it. Let's get started by breaking the white seal. It comes in dual colors that are white and blue. The box also has a user manual in it, having all the instructions for usage and troubleshooting. Let's keep this aside and talk about the product. quality of the material used is good. There is a hallmark on the device with Joe Pharma logo and manufacturing date on it. The model number is also written on the gun along with the measurement and battery specifications. The sensor used in this product is made in Taiwan and is one of the finest quality and accuracy. There is a cell compartment for two AAA batteries. If you can see, there is a positive and negative sign on it. So be careful while putting the batteries. This is a trigger button as you can see by pressing the trigger button the gun gets turned on. The gun has three buttons on one of the sides which are set, memory and mode. By pressing the mode button we can choose between body mode and surface mode. When we press the trigger the screen indicates the temperature of the body or the surface whichever was selected. So let's get started with the surface mode and see how it works. So here we have a glass of hot water and we point the sensor towards it and press the trigger button. We can see that the screen is now indicating the temperature of that surface. Now let's try it again with a pack of ice and we will repeat the same process. As we can see the reading of the cold surface on our screen that is 8.1 degrees Celsius. Now we will see how it works in the body mode by pressing the mode button. Now I will check my body temperature by pointing the sensor towards my hand and here we have the reading on our screen. The green light here indicates that it's the normal body temperature. So now I will use a cup of hot water again to see how it reacts to the high temperature body. It is showing us red color along with the temperature warning. This indicates this is not a safe temperature. Now we will again use the ice pack and see how the temperature gun reacts to the low temperature. It is now showing us a yellow light along with the temperature warning, low. Now we will see how the other buttons work. If we press the set button, we can change the temperature unit from Celsius to Fahrenheit and vice versa. We have another button in the middle, which is for the memory of the temperature readings taken by the gun, which shows us last 20 memories. I think it's a good product available in the market having international standards. The build quality is also very sturdy and feels very comfortable while also being very easy to use. 